Hudson. It's Grandmama. Look what I'm making. Isn't that pretty? I bet you like to make things too, don't you? Here's all my beads and I keep them in these seashells. And that way, let me show you. If I spill some, then this acts like a little scooper and I can scoop them back up. Isn't that cool? Here's more beads. And these are gourds. And those are more gourds. <laughs> uh, I don't have room to grow gourds, so we get them at the gourd farm. And then we make things like bird houses and musical instruments and um, drinking vessels like canteens. And we just make fun stuff with those. So, just saying hi. Hi, Edson. And this is my next bead project. That's the pattern I drew. Oops, it goes this way. But I don't have the beads for that one yet. That's my new thing I got. Well, it was going for a second. I grew, th grew these from a seed. Aren't those cool? I can't remember what they're called, but they're cool. This used to be a cow. I planted this when I moved here. It's called a jasmine. But it got too it got too big and I had to cut the one down from my yard. And these are the leftover pieces that grew up. Up the fence and grew into their yard and they still have it on their side. This is called a staghorn fern because it looks like deer antlers. And I just got these too. Cool. And this is parsley that I planted some seed. And it's just coming up. Here's another one. Not too many. This is called a spider plant. Each one of these is like a baby plant, and you can plant that in its own pot, and it'll grow a new one. That's how I got this one. <laughs> and this one. Uh, I think this is the first one, and then this is the second one. But it's winter, so I don't have much of a garden right now. Now it's going. <laughs> Here it goes. Alrighty. I hope I get to see you soon on my next trip. Or maybe you can come down here sometime. And uh, it's almost uh, St. Patrick's Day. So, <laughs> happy St. Patrick's Day. Oh, and today's your mom's birthday. <laughs> I forgot it was still Friday. So, uh, happy birthday.